p.m. I just woke up. The patient was back in the hospital because they wanted to reevaluate her before they allowed her to have her methadone. She's on the methadone program. She's on 39 milligrams. I'm on 25 milligrams. I missed my program today. So I was too tired to wake up. Very tired. I'm not supposed to go uptown to 114th Street to look at the script of my program. I'm attempting to have to take from my doctor. I left a two week script on the desk for me. I was supposed to go to a dermatological appointment today, which I needed to go to. I missed that because I was asleep. I have to call them to see if I can reschedule it sometime soon. I just smoked a cigarette. I'm extremely dizzy, as though it was the first cigarette I've ever smoked in my life. It feels as though possibly my body has been changed so that I don't need addictive drugs. Let's see how I feel without this methadone. Patrick seems to be okay without the methadone for several days. And when she takes this, she misses a little bit, don't smoke to get out of it. So she seems to be able to talk to me about any previously addicted to drugs. The story is fantastic, incredible, and most of you probably unbelievable. But to us, it's real. It's happening. We've had our sanity checked out by psychiatrists who said no. We're seeing. The nurse said, you know, the story you're telling me sounds like you'd be paranoid, but you're not, because I know you, and you're saying it. So, if you take what I give you, and face value, try to believe it, because I do not lie about things like this, never have, and probably never will. Of course, I need to told to, and I need to. This is not a case where I'm told to, or I need to, so you're getting the truth.